So today I'm gonna to be showing you how to sugar your upper lip. And as always, you do wanna start off with clean skin. So feel free to wash your face or take something like witch hazel to cleanse the area and then powder. And you can use any of the powders that I've listed in the description box. These are going to absorb any excess moisture or sweat that may be on your skin and help your sugar stick and actually remove the hair. And while you can use your sugar with strips, today I'm just gonna be using it with my hands as a paste. Remember, you always want to apply your sugar in the opposite direction that it grows. So since the hair tends to grow down towards the top lip, apply the sugar going up towards the nose. I like to first attack the outside corners of the mouth because that's just where I start and also this is where the hair tends to be the most visible. If your hair is a bit fine like my model or is more of a peach fuzz. Then I work my way into the cupid's bow area and also by going in a slightly diagonal motion this also really helps to catch really short hairs because if you have more of a peach fuzz rather than longer hair then those hairs can actually be harder to grab. And you'll notice that I tend to hold the tip of the nose up and I'm also telling my model to put tension in her top lip because remember you always want the skin to be taut or tight so that you're not tugging unnecessarily. And then when we're done you'll notice that not only is the hair gone but the skin also looks very soft. So when you're done you can either wipe down with just water or apply your witch hazel that you used in the beginning. This is going to again cleanse the skin. Or you can use a little bit of fresh aloe or aloe juice which this is going to help calm the skin and get rid of any inflammation so that redness will go away faster and then as a final step you want to protect and moisturize the skin so i used my diy aftercare balm and this is a chamomile infused oil which is again going to soothe the skin so that is how i use sugar paste to wax the upper lip but i did also film a brow video this day so my friend was kind enough to let me wax her brows because they're nice and full which mines are not and that will probably be coming in in like a few days so if you guys aren't already subscribed to this channel make sure that you do and give this video a thumbs up so that i know what you want to see more of i'll see you guys next week